Our other top story tonight, two people shot, including a teenager, inside a popular donut shop here in Philadelphia. This happened inside of Federal Donuts on 7th and Fairmont. It's where police say a 22-year-old was being chased and tried to get away, but the shooter kept opening fire inside the store and hit a 14-year-old. We sent NBC10 Sydney Long to the scene. She has details tonight. A uh, little bit after 1 o'clock, actually by 101 p.m., we received calls about shots fired here at the Federal Donuts. Investigators say a 14 year old became the latest innocent victim of gunfire. It happened as two shooters, according to police, began firing at a 22 year old man they were chasing. So, where you see the evidence markers, that's where the actual foot pursuit, for lack of a better term, began. Uh, and he was pursued through the parking lot, cut through the parking lot, and then ran into the Federal Donuts bind. The 22 year old sought safety inside the Federal Donuts store, and that's when a 14 year old boy, no affiliation, was struck twice in the leg. Both were rushed to Jefferson Hospital. The man in critical, the teenage boy in stable condition. Crazy, crazy. I get lunch here all the time, chicken sandwiches, you know, coffee in the morning. Residents like Xavier Luciano witnessed the police commotion while out on a run. Ultimately, for this to happen at Federal Donuts, like <laughs> at Federal Donuts, like that's too much. We'll be spending the next uh, very critical hours in reviewing all of the evidence, interviewing witnesses. Uh, and piecing everything together to find out what happened here. Like, this is probably the craziest thing I've seen all year, not gonna lie. And I live here. Commissioner Outlaw says the violent crime that unfolded here will not be tolerated or become the city's status quo. This at a time when she says something called on site shootings are on the rise. If someone wants to shoot someone, whether it's a pandemic, it's raining, it's snowing, or whatever it is, whenever they see them, regardless of the circumstances, they're going to shoot them. That's what we found. Reporting in Northern Liberties, Sydney Long, NBC 10 News.